click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, so welcome back to another video from the chapter Combinational Logic Circuit. So in today's video, we are going to see the application of DMUX. So you all know that what is the DMUX. In the previous videos, we have seen that what is the operation of the DMUX and how it can be performed. So DMUX is nothing but the demultiplexer and it is always known as one to many. Why? Because it has only one input and the many outputs. So DMUX has various applications in the digital electronic circuit as well as the various digital circuits where DMUX can be used for the various things. So let's see how the DMUX can be used for the digital electronic application. So the very first application of the DMUX is DMUX can be used to route input data to a specific output decided by a control word as a data demultiplexing. We all know that DMUX has a select lines that is also known as the control line. So by selecting a control lines or by selecting a inputs to the control line we can easily decide the specific input at the specific output so this is a very important application of the dmux now the next application is similarly dmux can be used for clock demultiplexing so we all know that the every circuit every timer circuit or the every counter circuit requires a clock in the digital electronic so suppose there is a very complex circuit where you require five to six counters as well as you require two to three another application we require the counters or the timers. So suppose there are five timers and the five counters. So if you don't have a demultiplexer circuit, what you will do, you have to provide a different clock to each and every circuit at the every point of a time. But if you are using a demultiplexer, what you can do is you can take one input as a one clock and then that one clock you can distribute to the other circuits using the DMAX application. How we can distribute? Suppose there is a 1 is to 8 demultiplexer. So that means it has one input and there are 8 output lines. So 8 output lines means you can distribute a clock, one clock to the 8 different specific outputs. So that means one clock can be distributed to the many counters and the many timer. So this is the very important and the very popular application of the DMUX, which can be used at the every point of the time of the digital electronic circuit. Now, the DMUX also performs a very important role in memory addressing by means of its decoder application. We have seen the decoder perform exactly the opposite operation of the encoder. That means it can convert a given coded signal into the binary form or it can decode a signal exactly opposite of the encoder. So decoder is a very popular application of the DMUX. And the very last application is it can be used for the switch encoding. For example, switch encoding, what do you mean by a switch encoding? Suppose there is a 1 is to 8 decoder or 1 is to 8 demultiplexer. Now by mean of the select lines or by mean of the control lines, you can easily switch between the outputs. That means depending on the inputs you are giving to the select lines you can easily switch the output or you can easily decide that which output has to become so this is nothing but the switch encoding applications these are the all the applications of the dmux circuit and it is very popular so mux and dmux plays a very important role in the combinational logic circuits as well as in the digital electronics so thank you friends for watching today's video we are going to see the more videos on the combinational logic circuits so in this chapter